Here for another Grizzly Spotlight covered by ATI Physical Therapy. This is Alec Casena, starting pitcher. I'm Roddy Rogers. And Alec, we're just going to kick this off. It's going to be a very fun uh, fun interview time yep. for you. Uh, for starters, you know, you played basketball since, or basketball, baseball, <laughs> rather, since you were uh, four years old, yep. played in the YMCA League. Yep. And I want to know, now that you're in the big leagues, who was your biggest inspiration growing up? Uh, biggest inspiration growing up as a young kid probably was Edgar Martinez. Um, Seattle Mariner, um, legend, uh, should be in the Hall of Fame in my opinion. Um, just a great hitter, just did everything the right way. Um, that's when I was a hitter. As a pitcher, I always loved Randy Johnson, another Seattle guy. Um, and then as I grew up, I started like uh, Carlos Zambrano, uh, Chicago Cub. I know we're in St. Louis, but... Uh, yeah, that doesn't hit. sit right with no, some, some Cardinal I, fans. I can't imagine, but <laughs> no, just his attitude towards the game, um, fiery. Get, got him some trouble a few times, but um, just a competitor, so I like to emulate emulate that. And a little backstory on Alec: He is from Seattle, and um, that's that's where he grew up. And this is what I wanted to lead into my next question for you. So you were drafted in the 16th round by the uh, Detroit Tigers, yep. and you bounced around in their minor league club for a year. And now you're here in Soje with the Gateway Grizzlies. How has the transition been like from location to location? Is it kind of routine now, or is it more routine if you're back home? Uh, at this point, it's routine. Um, with baseball, it's, you travel a lot. Um, even as you, you know, when I was 13, 14 years old, we were doing tournaments in Arizona, Atlanta, um, all over the place. So you kind of get used to the traveling aspect. Um, yeah, that's all I can really say about that, really. And he is uh, the, the leader in strikeouts, it seems, because all you do is strike people out <laughs> when you're throwing the ball. You had 52 last year and 13 starts, yeah. or 59 last year and 13 starts. This year he has 52 strikeouts and only six starts. So I want to know, is, has your approach been different? Have you gone to a more attacking style? But I know when you pitched in college and in high school, you were a strikeout type of guy too. So was last year uh, a, a change into let's have these guys put the ball more in play and then dig back to your roots this year and strike out? Or how, how have you been working with that? Um, last year, uh, I was coming back from a torn ACL um, in 2016 when I was with Detroit. Um, so I was, last year was my first full year, really, um, as a professional. Uh, but this year, I don't know, I'm just, all the pitches are working when I need them to. Um, and it's kind of nice where I don't have to be perfect um, because I have seven guys behind me and my catcher. Um, you know, that have my back. So it kind of makes everything a little easier with them. And this guy's very humble. He is a strikeout machine. <laughs> Don't let him fool you. And now uh, to wrap this thing up, this is more of the fun question. Yeah. He is a hitter at heart. Let me tell you, this guy was a first baseman in high school at, at your sophomore year, I believe it was. Yep. He transitioned to become a pitcher, yep. then went to Edmonds Community, and now he's here with the Grizzlies. But at the end of last year, yeah. you and the pitchers did a home run derby. Yeah. You hit the most home runs. You're yeah. a lefty. Yep. He's a righty thrower, a lefty hitter, and you just smacked the ball over the short fence and right. <laughs> he ended up winning out of the pitchers. Do you ever bug Phil into getting you to pinch hit in, in any game scenario? No, but I probably should. Nah. I, I mean, our hitters are doing a good job, but um, I love hitting the baseball. Every time I can, you know, put a bat in my hands, I like to have fun with it. And I'm not trying to hit doubles or anything at this point. I'm a pitcher, so I just go for home run or bust. <laughs> Even a double switch scenario? Maybe like, hey, let's let's put him back at first base where he started. Uh, no, I don't know. I don't know if you see me try to catch a fly ball, but it ain't pretty, so... <laughs> I'll just stick to pitching right now. <laughs> great, Alec. Well, he's doing a great job, and you can see him come out to the ballpark, watch him throw. He does a phenomenal job. Again, a strikeout guy. This is Alec Casana, starting pitcher of the Gateway Grizzlies, here for another Grizzly Spotlight covered by ATI Physical Therapy. Thank you for joining us.